of the most common types of network topologies you're likely to see today is a star topology. With a star topology, we've got a centralized device like a switch, like a Cisco Catalyst Ethernet switch. And starring off from that centralized switch, we have our clients. The clients are connecting into the outlets, the RG45 outlets in their offices and their cubicles. And everybody's interconnected in that switch. And the switch is going to make forwarding decisions based on the burned in MAC address, the media access control address present in the network interface cards in each of these devices. And with a star topology, if we were to lose a connection, if this link were to be severed some way, sure, this client just lost connectivity with the network, but notice this, everybody else continues to function as normal. Of course, the, the opposite side of that discussion is if we were to lose the switch itself, suddenly all of the clients, they've lost connectivity with the network. But be aware that when you are adding on clients in a wired network, you're probably going to be using this type of star topology.